Hey, y'all. Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time visiting, welcome. I hope you enjoy the content. If you do, please remember to subscribe to my channel and also get caught up. Go back and watch some of the older videos that we have. And don't forget, if they are helpful, remember to like the videos. And for my returning subscribers and visitors, welcome back. Today, we will simply be packaging a shirt. I finally finished this small order of 14 shirts um, that I had, and this is the shirt. It was done using the Cricut Maker, and it's just vinyl, and I need to package these shirts so that I can get it to the family, okay? And how I usually do that, I have this tagging gun, and I ordered this from off of Amazon.com. The link will be below. But this tagging gun allows me to add personalized labels to the shirt. Okay. And so this is simply um, something that I created in Microsoft Word, I think. But I could have definitely done this inside of any other design software, turned it into a PNG file, and the Cricut Maker, Silhouette, or whatever cutting device you have would be able to cut it for you. I'll also need my hole puncher, and this is a small hole puncher. I sometimes use this also to cut earring holes, but this will be for um, the tags, and I have plastic bags, little plastic um, t-shirt bags that I usually put each shirt in, All right? So let's get started. All right guys, so first we need to load the tagging gun and each tagging gun comes with about four of these needles and tag pins. And in order for us to load that, we are going to have to insert the needle and there's an opening on the needle right here, your fingernail or whatever can go through, that's for the tagging pins to be able to go through. So you want to make sure that that is aligned with the opening on the actual tagging gun, okay? And there is a, a little knob on the side for you to tighten it. And then you will turn it to nine o'clock and see it's, now it is straight and it is tightly inside. You can't pull it out. Okay, next you are going to insert the tagging pins and this is the side that you will enter into the slot. This slide is, you'll see the difference. And this side fits perfectly into the slot and there will be a little click once it's inside. Okay, so our tagging gun is ready for us to tag these shirts. All right, guys, so all you need to do is put a hole into your tags, and you have a small little hole, and you will then take your, your tagging gun, put the hole, put the needle into the hole, and then all you have to do is stick that hole into the fabric or into wherever you are going to be placing your hole. I'm putting it right here in the center on the tag and then you hold it close and then you click and then you see it goes on to there and all you have to do is slide your needle out and then you can do this with either scissors or you can just pull on it and it will pop off. And now you have a nice professional looking shirt with a tag on it, with your own personal tag on it. Okay, so once that is all set, I will fold the shirt. Of course, I kind of fold it so that that tag will be seen through the plastic bag 
and part of the image also can be seen through the bag. All right, so our shirt is folded and all I'm going to do now is put it into our cellophane bag and we are just going to put it so where they can see the size of the shirt in case usually in big orders sometimes you know they don't have time or they don't really want it's an inconvenience to have to open each bag and see what size shirt it is so I try to make sure that there is um, some place where they can tell from the outside where or what size the shirt is As you guys can see here on this side, they'll get the bag. They will see that this shirt was made with love from Craftable Things, and it's a size small. Also, I did not tell you. Also, these are care instructions for um, vinyl shirts and how to wash it. Okay, and this is how they will get their shirts. All right. All right, y'all. So this is it, and this is how I package my shirts. Remember, you're never too small to do big things, and this is a nice professional presentation for when your customers receive their items that you are making with love and all of your creativity. So. And that's how I package my shirts. I love my tagging gun. So if you are interested in putting your own label on your shirts, you can get this tagging gun below. It's going to be in um, the description. And there are all types of other tagging guns. So shop around, look for um, one that suits your needs. But this one is pretty easy to use. It's very cut and dry of how to even set it up. All right, so that's it for today. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to like the video. And also, if you are not already, become a subscriber. Hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell so that you can be notified of when we post new content. And that's it. Thank you all so much for watching. Until next time. Yeah.